So you'll already know about that dip on the apex of T1, which allows you to do a little bit more turning quite quickly. Um, but what I'm really talking about in terms of a speed trick is that doing that turning early allows you to straighten the wheel and basically accelerate in a straight line as you exit towards the curb. This one quite simple really. I've always found that you can carry more speed through Eau Rouge and Radion if you enter the corner from mid-track. Turns five, six, seven are basically just all about using the curbs. Uh, the main speed trick that you have through this complex um, is the curb going into turn six. But you want to be using all of the curbs, like this inside curb in turn five. But um, the beginning of turn six, it's really important that you get back over to the left side of the track once you exit turn six which can be pretty difficult if you're carrying a lot of speed, but this curb, um, if you just accelerate very slightly on that curb, it brings the car around, almost as if it's like a half spin. Um, it's quite subtle and it takes a bit of practice, but if you accelerate a little bit over that curb, it'll really help the car to turn, which means it's easier to get over onto the left side, um, because most of the speed really is trying to maintain full throttle through the final part through turn seven. Um, but yeah, you just got to use all of the curbs. Uh, so there's loads of time to be had in this corner. Um, especially by get, getting up on the curbs. Um, you probably know that one about the entrance curb there, getting up on the ramp kind of shoots you into the corner. Uh, but I like to use this inside curb, just get right up on the inside curb. The back gets a little bit more slippery. As you get on the accelerator, it, it brings the back end round, giving you um, a really early point for your acceleration, but also um, a good more bit of turning so that you avoid the off track on the exit. <laughs> So this footage is from a different session. It's a better example of uh, using the same trick on the inside curb. So you'll see as I come around this corner, I get onto the curb entirely. Uh, I'm accelerating as I hit the curb, and that just brings the front and the uh, the front round, the back round a bit, um, just pointing you in a, a better direction so that you can continue to accelerate properly uh, without getting onto that curb. Obviously the the earlier you accelerate through that corner, uh, the more speed you'll end up carrying through the entire back straight. So it's quite a, quite a good trick to get a little bit of speed. <laughs> 